Okay, so today we're going to talk about how to make sure that you have the hardware acceleration turned off so that when you're using Camtasia Studio to make recordings, they will um, display properly after you publish them. And so I'm here in Cam Studi Camtasia Studio, and let's say that I have a uh, project that I've been working with, and I'll just load it here. And you can see that I have a screen, uh, and if I played it, um, it would it would have narration and uh, and also movement. And so the problem is when you go to produce the video, uh, you choose to. In this case, I'm going to choose YouTube. And if I went through all of that and produced the video, which I won't right now because of time issues. Um, <coughs> it would look like this. And so I chose it to be a .mov file. And as you can see, um, the screen does not look very good. And when I play it, the audio is fine, but the video is not. And so what the problem is, and what you should probably check first, is to make sure that you have hardware acceleration turned off. And the way that you do that is you can uh, you need to go to your display settings. There's a number of ways to get there. I will talk about one. You can just right click anywhere on the desktop and choose properties and then choose the settings tab in the display properties window. Uh, once you have that you just click the advanced button and in the advanced button then we want to choose the troubleshoot tab. And what you'll do right here where it says hardware acceleration, uh, this is for Windows XP by the way, um, I would move that hardware acceleration to none. Go ahead and apply it. You'll see that the screen goes from black uh, and then back to display. And I say OK. I say OK to the display settings. Now the nice thing is I don't even need to go back into Camtasia and republish my video. When I load that same file that I created and I play it, even though I created it with the hardware uh, acceleration, even with it enabled, as long as I go back and I take that, disable it, I can then play the video and the audio, and as you see, the video turns out just fine. Okay, so you can see, and I moved the timeline ahead there just so that you could see that the video was actually moving. And so that's all you need to do. Again, we just go to pro our display properties. I can right click on the desktop, settings, advanced, troubleshoot, and then make sure that we have the hardware acceleration turned off. And so that's it uh, for today. Um, Sometimes that can be a frustrating experience, um, but it's actually very easy to, to correct. Uh, so you can let me know how, how, this, how helpful this was or not, and um, uh, have fun with Camp Camtasia Studio.